So we've been waiting for Faith to have her calf. And I'll be honest, we had, I thought like a month ago, she was gonna definitely have it. She was getting so big. She was starting to bag up. And it was the first time with a jersey having a calf. So we were like all excited, you know, couldn't wait. All right, we feel like this morning is the morning. <laughs> I feel like we've said that so many times coming here to check on Faith, but she has separated herself away from the rest of the herd. We see all the other ones are at the hay ring and they're eating. And so we are going to see what she's doing right now. So here she is, still very, very pregnant. She's eating a lot, getting that baby lots of good nutrition. You can see her udders are absolutely huge. I'm gonna zoom in so you can see. She has to be close. So then at about three weeks, she started discharging mucus some. And I was like, okay, she's definitely gonna have it like right away, right away. So we were like kind of baby watch. Good morning. It is Saturday morning. And so we are walking out here bright and early to check on Faith, see if there is a calf out here and just see how she is doing. So we'll give you an update as soon as we get out to the pasture. And then the more and more I read that it was kind of normal for them to do that for a couple weeks. So time went on. I was checking on her every night, every morning, on the weekends, constantly throughout the day. On our way to go check on Faith, and at this point, I'm just like, there's not gonna be a baby calf out there, but we'll see if there is. We got Faith and Hallie side by side here. Faith still's got a baby in there. Lisa was going out of town Friday morning, so that night before she left, Faith had her calf. which leaves me here home all alone to try to do milking all by myself for the first time. So I had a little bit of experience with milking, but not a whole lot. I'm really thankful for our friend Jeremiah who let me help him milk their cows a few times. And he was on standby. If I needed help, I could give them a call. And I talked to him that morning, kind of like, hey man, like how's this going? Told me like a few little pointers on what to do or what not to do. And then literally that afternoon, around, I'd say, two or three in the afternoon, our package for our milking, our, our hand milking set showed up. It was delayed by one day, so I knew it was coming. So I was waiting, waiting, waiting. And when it showed up that afternoon, I milked Faith for the first time on my own. So I recorded it, but I wasn't able to talk too much because I was focusing more on making sure I took care of her. And it was a lot of fun. It was really like, I, honestly, it was really awesome to do, but I was definitely nervous. 
and things went pretty well. There was a few little things like little hiccups here and there that happened, but nothing that was really detrimental to the whole process at all. And she did well, I did well. We got some, well, it was colostrum at the time. So we saved that in case there's an emergency down the road. I did it all by myself. I'm pretty proud of myself. That was cool. And literally everything's going really well with us milking her. She's a, she's a champ, she's awesome. So today we're gonna milk her again and we're gonna show you a little bit more of what we're doing now. I feel a little bit more comfortable with it. I'm gonna talk a little bit more. So here I'm hand milking her and I'm just I'm just trying to relieve the pressure off her, but I can tell that the little baby has been drinking pretty good off of her. This one's pretty cool. This is awesome. I'm just trying to relieve the pressure because I know the cat's drinking, but they're such, these jerseys are such overproducers and her calf is half Dexter. So it doesn't need as much milk as she's producing. I can tell that he's been drinking though because these things aren't nearly as distended as they were before. Checking to make sure she's not too hot. She feels good. It's definitely loosened her up a little. I'm gonna take this out. Basic, you did awesome. Good job, good job.
All right, so that was a huge success. Everything went really well with that. Now, we're still within a week of her calving. So we're saving this right now. We're freezing it. We're not drinking it, but we are freezing this to save it in case there's an emergency. Later on with another calf down the road, we're going to have basically a week's worth of milk to give to that calf if we were to have to in, so, in any sort of emergency. But today, really successful. Faith was a champ like always. She did great. And thank you for watching.